plane And then the spirit came Blowing wind and tongues of flame And everything was changed Gathered in an upstairs room With Jesus' friends together But when the wind began to blow wasn't just the weather God's Holy Spirit filled that place and of fire too. Appeared on each disciple's head The sign of something new For tongues of fire soon turned into Tongues of every nation And Jesus' friends could speak them all Without an education It was the Feast of Pentecost the Jews from every land were gathered in Jerusalem. They didn't understand. God's Holy Spirit filled that place. And tongues of fire too. Appeared on each disciple's head. A sign of something new. Blowing wind and tongues of They can speak to each of us in our own tongues in Latin, French and Greek. But one man not so courteous said, this is what I think. They're babbling, they make no sense, they've had too much to drink. So Peter stood and told the clothes. These men are sober friends, but promise this, it's coming from the spirit that he sends. The prophet Joel told us plain that one day we dream dreams. Men and women, old and young, that day has come, it seems. It seems, it seems, it seems. For God's own spirit falls on all. Cried to Peter, tell us what to do. Repent and be baptized, he said. Receive God's Spirit too. So that is what the people did. Three thousand were baptized and followed Jesus from that day. Reborn, renewed alive. God's Holy Spirit filled that place. Disciples' heads, a sign of something new. Blowing wind and tongues of flame. And the spirit came. Blowing wind and tongues of flame. And everything was changed. Was changed. Was changed.